Hello, this is Patrick at 1CNC West, and what we're going to do in this training video is take a look at creating our very first CNC program for our first project. Now, over on the right hand side of the screen, you'll see all of our different machining operations. We performed a facing, a profile, and also a drill cycle. All right, now to create our CNC program, take your cursor up here where it says Toolpath Group, where this orange strip is, and just right hand mouse click. Once you do that, you're going to get this drop down menu, and from here, you want to select Post Group. All right, once you do that, you're going to get this dialog box. The first thing you want to take note of is which post processor has been selected. Now, really quick, a post processor is responsible for creating the correct CNC code for your machine tool. So if you have a Haas machine tool, you want to make sure you have the Haas post processor selected. If you have a Fidal machine tool, you want to make sure that you've got the Fidal post processor selected. Very, very simple. Now when you click on this button, you'll notice that there's over 100 post processors that ship with one CNC. I should also point out that it's very simple to create additional post processors and to make edits to these as well. I'm going to put this back to the Haas. So let's scroll down. I'm going to find the Haas and left hand mouse click on that. This information right here can be output within the CNC program and also within the setup sheet. We'll talk about this in just a little bit. But for right now, make sure you've got the right post processor selected and then simply click post. And from this dialog box, what you do is you designate where you want to save your program and what you want to name it. In this example, I'm going to save my program to the desktop and I'm calling it CNC Program 1. So I'll click Save. I'm going to overwrite the file that I already have, so I'll click Yes. 1CNC is going to post process all those machining operations. And here's our very first program. This is a program that's created for the Haas machine tool. Very, very nice. Now, what we'll do now is let me demonstrate how we can create a job sheet. So I'm going to go back up here to the toolpath group and again I'm going to right hand mouse click. Again we're going to select post group just like we did before but instead of selecting post we're going to grab job sheet. Now job sheet's going to look at this information as well. Right now I'm going to leave it the way it is but for example if I change the, uh, the author to how about Patrick Matthews. Okay this is just a quick example. Now we're going to go to job sheet when you click on job sheet, 1CNC gives you a nice preview of the job sheet. And I don't have very much uh, screen capture area, so I can't show you, but listed at the very bottom of this job sheet, you have the ability to print this or save it. This is just a preview, remember. I'm going to move this down just a little bit, and I'm going to select save. And I'm just going to call this, I'll just call this job one. Whoops, job one. That looks good, so we'll click save. So what that does now is that creates a PDF file. Let's take a look at that PDF file. I'm going to load that up. So here is our, our job sheet created for this particular part. Notice how it shows the datum. That's what the X is. It shows different views and it also shows the toolpath. If we come up to the top here, this shows some inf the pertinent information. Notice, remember I changed the author to Patrick Matthews. It's listed here. Here's a list of all the tools. There's a cycle time and date and so on. And if we come down here, it's going to list every one of the operations along with their cycle time and pertinent information as well. It's a very professional looking job sheet. Thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.